Hello guys, welcome to this week's Tight Tuesday. So, as you can probably tell, and if you can't, can you tell what it is yet? In the words of the immortal Rolf Harris, uh, no, it's Portal. And uh, I'm just going to have a look at the, the demo version of this, and uh, if you don't know what Tight Tuesdays are already, um, they're basically a quick look at uh, any sort of old or new game. Um, I haven't actually played very much of Portal, so I thought it'd be a bit of a throwback for you guys as well to um, to play this. So uh, on we go, brand new game of Portal the First Slice. So if you don't know already, Portal is based on um, the Half-Life engine, or the same engine as Half-Life. And uh, yeah, it's it's a little bit old now, a few years old, but uh, still, I've always wanted to play Portal. Um, played a little bit of it on the Orange Box when it came out. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all enrichment center activities, serious injuries may occur. For your own safety and the safety of others, please refrain from... Turn back. The portal will open in three, two, one. <laughs> so yeah, it's based on the orange and blue portal things that you can just walk through. And that's the basis for the game really. Ooh, camera, scary camera. And it's all puzzle based. So, I guess what we have to do Excellent. is weigh that down. Please proceed into the chamber lock after completing each test. First, however, note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material emancipation grill will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. For instance, the aperture science weighted storage cube. Can we try out the cube? No. That's a shame. Okay, well that that's just telling us that we can't do that. Then. There we go, that's level one done, I'm guessing. Although, uh, to be honest, I don't think it works off level, because it's more just a, a free roaming... Well, not free roaming, but more of an open puzzle game. So. Although this is puzzle one. Okay, fine. Please place the weighted storage cube on the 1500 megawatt aperture science heavy duty super colliding super button. Okay. <laughs> uh. We need to get through to the cube. There it is. Ah, oh, crap. There we go. Perfect. Please move quickly to the chamber lock, as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. Just gotta wait for the portal, and uh, there we go. Cool. So yeah, this has kind of been a big franchise for Valve. You're doing very well. 
Please be advised that a noticeable taste of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grip, which may, in semi-rare cases, emancipate dental fillings, crowns, tooth enamel, and teeth. 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 I just love the way that <laughs> the voice just jumps up and down. Aha! This is where we get to. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. Yeah. With it, you can create your own portals. These interdimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. Do not look directly at the operational end of the device. Do not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. Most importantly, under no circumstances should you. Should I go? Please proceed to the chamber lock. Mind the gap. Interesting. Aha! I get it. I think. Please again. proceed to the chamber lock. Mind the gap. Remember, the Aperture Science Bring Your Daughter to Work Day is the perfect time to have her tested. <laughs> Very clever. I am not, unfortunately. Welcome to Test Chamber 4. You're doing quite well. Required test protocol. We will not monitor the next test chamber. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. Okay. I love the fact this is padded. Is that because it will send us mad or, <laughs> or just because?
of a required test protocol. Our previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, one. one of many enrichment center goals. The Aperture Science High Energy Pellet seen to the left of the chamber can and has caused permanent disabilities such as vaporization. Please be careful. <laughs> Unbelievable. You. Subject name here. Must be the pride of. Subject hometown here. <laughs> Warning devices are required on all mobile equipment. However, alarms and flashing hazard lights have been found to agitate the high energy pellet and have therefore been disabled for your safety. Good. Now use the aperture science on stationary scaffold to reach the chamber lock. Noticing similarities between the gravity gun and this thing. You can buy one of these if you want. Play.com. Costs you about 80 quid. Please know that we have added a consequence for failure. Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record, followed by death. Good luck. <laughs>
Ah. Please note that any appearance of danger is merely a device to enhance your testing experience. A bit of challenge to the mind. The Enrichment Center regrets to inform you that this next test is impossible. Make no attempt to solve it. for this clearly broken test chamber. Once again, the Enrichment Center offers its most sincere apologies on the occasion of this unsolvable... Fantastic! You remain resolute and resourceful in an atmosphere of extreme pessimism. <laughs> that was easier than the last one. The last one was all to do with aiming and everything. It was a bit of a pain, but still making good progress. To reiterate, previous one, must <laughs> momentum. Pardon? Precise how it does not. Oh, whoops. Momentum, a function of mass and velocity, is conserved between portals. In layman's terms, speedy thing goes in, speedy thing comes out. <laughs>
Well guys, sorry to uh, cut that short there, but it uh, looks like that's the end of the demo, so um, yeah, thanks very much for watching. If you've got any ideas for future t uh, Tight Tuesdays, then just let me know in the comments or by a private message. And don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe, and do check out my latest Let's Play, which is Black Mesa. Um, there's a bit of a delay on getting that up because there's just so much content there. I've literally got a terabyte hard drive full of stuff there so um, just bear with me with that but um, yeah hope you enjoyed this tight Tuesday and check out next week's which is yet to be confirmed but uh, if you've got any ideas that you want to get in quick then just drop me a message and I'll see what I can do cheers guys